You are all aware that the Swachh Bharat campaign launched by India's Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi has become an effective and amazing national movement. People across the country are taking to the streets and in their homes, making sure that clean India is the new India. One of India's leading international organizations in terms of a non-governmental organization is Sulab International. In West Bengal, a particular part of West Bengal, people's health was badly affected by drinking water that was poisoned by arsenic. So Sulab decided on an indigenous method of treatment to remove the arsenic so that people could get fresh and healthy drinking water. We bring you this special report on what Sulab did in the Indian state of West Bengal to provide safe and healthy drinking water without spending too much of money, without any kind of technology that is imported from outside to make water, pure, safe drinking water available to the people living in that part of India. Many states in India has problem of arsenic water and people when they drink they get many diseases and you will see sometimes they get cancer also and the whole body you will find full of wounds and it is unbearable to see the face of anybody who is suffering from arsenic diseases. It was detected in 1982-83 in West Bengal for the first time. But now it's not Bengal. We have in many states like Bihar, Chhattisgarh, Jharkhand, even in some parts of Uttar Pradesh, like these areas have problem of arsenic water. To solve the problem, we have given a new solution to the problem that you should collect water in your pond and that water we can treat for drinking purposes. So there is no arsenic in the water. And uh, we have made experiments in West Bengal in five, six places like Madhusudan Kati, uh, Bidnapur, Mayapur, and uh, one, two more places like Santi Niketan also. So what we have found that uh, people were suffering because of drinking uh, water with arsenic. In those areas, now we have purified water from the ponds, from the wells, and that is being supplied to the people for big purposes. So what do we do? We collect water in the pond, and there we have a system of treating the water through alum, also uh, through micro membranous technology, and doing all these things, they get good quality water to drink. It is sold at the rate of 50 pesos per liter. In the beginning, it was 200 liters per day. Now it is more than 12,000 liters per day is being supplied, and a great demand is there. And that we're helping those who had uh, effect of arsenic, now they are being cured by that uh, water. So this is an example, and also we have uh, provided water uh, where diarrhea, dysentery was causing. It's not, not causing now, but especially if I come back to Matsun Kati, this experiment has become very, very successful, and we can have this air plant throughout the country, wherever there is arsenic, and you can treat water. The cost is 50 percent per liter. It's negligible, and it gives employment. Three per two, four persons, permanent employment, four persons in one plant. Doing construction uh, gives more employment, but for running the plant, four persons are required. And they're totally viable. So you have not depend on subsidy or anything else. You are selling the water and getting money, and people are very, uh, getting benefited. So this is a good experiment we have done in uh, Mosul Kati in West Bengal, and I hope. We are going to extend these facilities to other parts of the country where people are suffering from arsenic water.